You're watching Cron 4 News at 10. Thanks for joining us at 10. I'm Noel Bello. It has been a wild 48 hours for former President Trump after an assassination attempt on Saturday. A federal judge has dismissed his classified documents case and he's announced his running mate, Ohio Senator and former Silicon Valley investor, J.D. Vance. He also made an appearance tonight at the Republican National Convention. In the midst of all the headlines, Trump supporters here in the Bay Area are coming together. Crown Force Sarah Stinson joining us live in studio after speaking with the group who gathered in the East Bay today. Sarah, what did you hear from them tonight? Well, Noel, Trump supporters say they are still reeling from what happened on Saturday, so they decided to gather and rally to show strength and unity. <laughs> People driving home from work on 580 in Pleasanton honked in support of a Trump rally Monday afternoon. This just two days after an attempted assassination was made on former President Donald Trump. Trump supporters described watching the terrifying moment on TV. I was paralyzed, paralyzed and shocked that somebody would do something like that to anybody, let alone a former president. We were watching it live and my wife broke down in tears and when we didn't know what was happening, it was just, it was gut-wrenching. Supporters say they were relieved to see Trump was okay after being grazed by a bullet. He was seen at the Republican National Convention Monday night with a bandage over his right ear. I immediately knew he was okay because our President Trump showed uh, much strength and resilience when um, he stood up and, you know, showed his fist and said, let's fight. Hours ahead of his appearance at the RNC, Trump announced his running mate as U.S. Senator J.D. Vance of Ohio. The 39-year-old is now in his first year in the Senate and has previously worked as a venture capitalist in Silicon Valley. Trump supporters say they are very happy 